is about this one woman who loses her husband um, in any time period, that's going to be hard. Um, but the fact of the matter is, is that this is back in the day where women had no livelihood unless it was from their father or their husband. Um, and so she's left with her mother-in-law, Naomi, that you've got to think about since that she's a young woman, her marriage has got to be pretty short and not that long. So she doesn't know her mother-in-law that well. Um, and she leaves her family entirely with this woman that she barely knows and goes to a different town, city, country. And this is back when there wasn't any cars or planes to go anywhere, so it would have taken months for two women to travel dangerously um, on a path to a place that they don't even know whether or not they're going to have a good livelihood. Um, so they get there and they start up a new life. And these are women starting up a new life, no money, no job, hardly any food. And they find um, this guy Boaz's um, farm and milk, and she decides that she's going to pick up grain from there, and this is how she's going to support, um, this is how Naomi has decided that Ruth is going to support um, the family and how they're going to live because um, Boaz is Naomi's relative. Um, so, before this, Ruth said that she was going to abandon everything, including her own face, and turn to, um, turn to Naomi's face, which is a pretty big deal, because we're assuming that she knew nothing about this God, and she just dropped it, um, dropped everything she knew, just to come, to come forward with faith. And that, uses a lot of faith. Um, a lot of women, including myself, wouldn't have that amount of faith or trust in anybody, really. Um, and Ruth trusts Naomi so much that she goes in the dead of night to sleep at the foot of Boaz's, um, Boaz while he sleeps. Well, I don't know about you, but if I just snuck into someone's room and I sleep with them, you don't really get a good reputation for that, so it's high risk. And this is back in the day where you couldn't just sleep with anyone you liked. Um, you were considered a whore if you spent too much time with one person. And she risked her reputation and her name just because her mother-in-law did that. And some people would call it stupid, um, while most Christians would call it a huge leap of faith. And she didn't just have leap a faith in um, Naomi, but she also had faith in God. Um, in the end, it went off well. Um, Boaz ended up marrying Ruth, and yeah, it, is, it has a good demonstration to Christians about faith and everything like that.